A, B, C, D, one, two, three. What are you counting on my teeth? Hey guys, I'm Chris. I'm a registered dental hygienist and first ambassador. Going to the dentist can be already stressful enough for some patients. And sometimes the most disorienting part of it all is the numbers and letters that are being said throughout your appointment. You're probably wondering, what the heck are y'all labeling in my mouth? The teeth numbering system that we use helps us determine which teeth we are talking about when it comes to treatment and more. As dental professionals, this is something that we learn in school. And we even go into the anatomy and the histology of the teeth and all that. But if you're curious and want to know what your dentist is talking about, or if you're a parent and you're just trying to figure out which teeth are coming in on your child, then please keep watching. Now, there are different formats when it comes to numbering teeth, but in today's video, I'm going to show you the universal numbering system for adult teeth and children's teeth. So let's start with children's teeth, or what we like to call primary teeth. Makes sense, right? Because we have to have children's teeth in order to get our permanent teeth most times. So by the age of five or six, your child's mouth is going to have 20 teeth. 10 on the top and 10 on the bottom. The first primary teeth usually erupts between six to 10 months old. So when it comes to numbering primary teeth or children's teeth, we're gonna actually label them with letters. So that's kind of easy to remember when it comes to figuring out which teeth we're talking about. Are we talking about the primary teeth or we're talking about the permanent teeth? So primary teeth is most likely gonna have a letter differentiating which tooth it is. And when it comes to numbering your teeth, we always begin with your upper right side. Your your other right. <laughs> your, your right side. So we're gonna start with your upper right. So starting on the very last tooth on the upper right, we're going to begin with A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, and that is the last tooth on the top, so you have a total of 10 teeth on the top. And now moving our way to the bottom teeth, we're going to start with the last letter on the left side. Your left, no, your, the other left. <laughs> your left, so since we left off with J, we're gonna continue on labeling K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, N, T. And now we've completed the rest of the primary teeth, 10 on the bottom, 10 on the top, and there you go. Your primary teeth from A to T. Now for our adult teeth, AKA the permanent teeth. A full set of adult teeth or permanent teeth will typically amount to 32 teeth in total. And just like the primary teeth, we're going to start with the very last tooth on your upper right, which is typically your third molar or your wisdom tooth. So we will start with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16 and 16 is the last molar on your upper left. So now you've completed the top teeth. Now we're gonna move down to the bottom teeth. And just like we did with the primary teeth, we're gonna start with your very last molar on your lower left. Yes, your wisdom tooth. Yes, your third molar. So since we left off with 16, we're gonna continue on going to 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, and 32. The very last tooth on your lower right, which typically would be your wisdom tooth again. And those are your permanent teeth, one through 32. I hope this video was helpful, and if you have any questions, please feel free to comment down below. Also, be sure to like this video for more content like today. And thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for more Burst TV every week. Bye y'all.